Hi, I'm Josh Hansen, number 15 with the Chilliwack Chiefs. Fraser Valley Distant Education School is one of the largest online schools in BC. FVDES currently has over 3,000 students taking BC curriculum at the elementary and high school levels. To find out more about this interesting way to do school, visit their website at www.fvdes.com. Get up in front of that as well. Sam Johnson in the box for Merritt. 16 seconds to go in the first period. McNaughton point shot, rebound. Do you have a Tony? Just missed. Put it off the side of the post. Chiefs almost get one late. McNaughton with eight seconds. Another slap shot. Scores! Keeper McNaughton through a crowd. Chiefs get the late power play goal at 19.54. Diamatoni couldn't put the puck in the rebound on the first time, Cam, but it came back to the blue line, and the veteran defenseman, Kiefer McNaughton, making no mistake. Yeah, Kiefer McNaughton just wound up and blasted that without Matthew Tibbet in front of the net. That goal doesn't happen, and Kiefer came out of his skin. He was pretty excited on that one. Pare back the other way over the Chilliwack line. Left side, Patterson redirect. He scores. Scott Patterson set up by Sebastian Pare. Great play by the Sense off the rush and the counterattack. Matthew Tibbet got caught in behind the play. Centennials reverse, and Scott Patterson, one of their best forwards, beats Lyndon Stanwood on the redirect in front. Centennials take a 2-1 lead. And the Merritt Centennials. Centennials setting up at the power play here. Pulse into the middle. Martin fakes the slap shot. Goes for James Neal in the left circle, being played physically by T.J. Roche along the boards. As T.J.'s back in the lineup tonight. Neal left circle, a shot, he scores. James Neal through a, a crowd, went five-hole on Stanwood, who I don't think saw it. So the Centennials have struck in the power play just 17 seconds into the man advantage. They've scored three unanswered now. It's a 3-1 merit lead with nine minutes to go. Battle in the corner ensues. Roberts can't dig it out. Comes right to Martin, he scores. Tyler Martin in the left circle. That puck came right out to him. I'm not sure if it came off a Chilliwack stick or not. But the Centennials have scored three unanswered here in the second period. Their second power play goal of the period. And they've taken a 4-1 lead just like that. Schaefer with it. Left side into the middle. Jake Clifford. Peyton Schaefer. Back for Jake. Clifford into the middle between the circles. Patterson a shot. He scores. Scott Patterson. High to the blocker's side on Josh Halpany. Another power play goal for Merritt. Their power play has exploded in the second period three times with the man advantage. Merritt has scored, and more importantly, they lead 5-1 here in the second with a minute 50 to go. And very simple, just passing it right to back to the point, getting lots of good movement. Carter Cochran back to the left point. 15 seconds to go in the period. Rush, left side. Cochran, left circle, cross ice. Diamantoni in front. Tibbet scores. Nice look by Zach Diamantoni, Matthew Tibbet with the goal. And the Chiefs have a little bit of life here. That's the first of the year for Tibbet. It's a 5-2 hockey game with 10 and a half seconds to go here in the second. Yeah, and that's a bit of a sign of life. Uh, Matthew Tibbet getting his first of the year. Sebastian Paré, Patterson, high slot in the Chilliwack zone. Wrist shot. He scores. How he got a piece of it? Cooper Rush kind of stopped on the play as the puck hopped over the pad of Halpenny and rolled over the goal line. A 6-2 Merritt lead with 4.52 to go in the third period. And I don't want to say that looked like a give up there, Cam, but it kind of did at the end there. I think Rush had a chance to make a play on that puck and maybe just ran out of time. Centennials take a 6-2 lead. Carter Cochran has to turn against Diego Cuglietta. Cuglietta wins the battle. Centers it in front. They score. Another goal for the Centennials. Side of the net, it's Gavin Gould getting in on the fun. It's 7-2 with 3.19 to go. And another example, Cam, you're down 6-2. Carter Cochran loses the battle to Cuglietta. Quick centering pass, and Gavin Gould cashes in. It's a five-goal centennial lead. They knock off Chilliwack by a score of 7-2 on a night where Chilliwack simply was just not good enough against a good merit hockey team. We'll take a break and come back with more. You are listening to Murray Honda, Chilliwack Chiefs Hockey on 89.5 The Drive. 